These four walls see so much beauty and so much hard work. Anna Nikulina and Dennis Rodkin are two of the Bolshoi's biggest stars. Nikulina has been performing the role of Clara in the Nutcracker, or Marie as she's known in the Russian version, since 2006. Every performance gives you the feeling of a fairy tale, of magic, and that's the difference between this and other shows. It's almost a miracle it's on, as Covid ripples through the Bolshoi on its virulent journey through Russia. That means some unexpected extra shifts for a lot of the dancers. Have you had to step into roles oh, that yeah. you're not prepared for? Oh, yes, like today, we have uh, La Baia there in the evening, and I was not supposed to do it, uh, but I'm doing it. And I've been told, like, yesterday, you're doing it. I was like, okay, because the girl got sick. And even, like, if one person got, like, sick, then all of a sudden, everyone in a dressing room or, or the partners, they have to also isolate and, like, like, lots of people just go out in one day. But at least it's better than um, lockdown. To fill her days then, Turazashvili gave online classes. And down to your knee. Oh. I really kept myself uh, busy and occupied and, and tired. And uh, I was doing it every single day, like every single day. And uh, it helped me a lot, yes. The Bolshoi was closed for six months. Dancers were sent a bar and special flooring so they could practice at home. Performances restarted in September, and despite high COVID numbers inside and out, the doors have stayed open since. You are required for your own safety to keep social distance and to wear face masks while at the washroom. The show has gone on, but only thanks to substantial state subsidies. When the theatres reopened, they were allowed to sell 50% of their seats. But at the end of November, because of the COVID situation, that was brought down to just 25%. That meant that a lot of people this Christmas saw their tickets for the Bolshoi cancelled. Legend. Uh, Dennis Rodkin had the virus already in September. Small, He's grateful for the antibodies really and for the fact that he has an audience to dance for. People in Russia love ballet so much that I'm sure that even if there are only 5% of spectators in the auditorium, we'll still feel 100% support from them. I'm very grateful to all of those people that come to our performances and support us. Support from spectators is the most important thing for any performing artist. The Nutcracker is the story of a little girl's dream. An escape into a fairy tale where toys come alive, nutcrackers turn into princes, and good triumphs over evil. It's a magical escape from a bleak year, for those lucky enough to see it, and for the performers too. Diana Magne, Sky News, Moscow.